Okay, so here we have a uh, front end out of a late model Colorado. How do you get the axle shaft out of the front end? It looks fairly simple. With There's a bolt here, there's a, there's a bolt in the back in the same spot. It looks like all you have to do is just pull these bolts out and the tube will slide out. It's not the case. That's not how you, you take these apart. The axle actually has to come out of the end of the housing. The arm stays in the housing. So what we're going to show you to do, show you today is how to disassemble uh, the the four wheel drive actuator and all the good all the stuff inside and pull the axle shaft out. So for starters, obviously, well the first thing that we already I already did is I pulled I just pulled the bracket off. You don't have to; it just makes it easier. Um, in fact, really the first thing you do pop pop the axle seal out. Now that it's on film, it's not going to go. There we go. Next, take off the actuator. And be mindful, there, there's, actual, there's an actual uh, gasket here. Try not to tear the gasket because it is fairly substantial. It, it'll ca cause uh, interference issues if you, if you don't put it back in. So if it stays stuck, go ahead and leave it, but I always prefer just... Just carefully removing it. So with that removed, your next step is you need to pull this, this big old snap ring. It's kind of a... Because this, this needs to slide out next. And odds are good you're going to shoot it across the room. There it is. <laughs> yeah, so here's that, here's that nice big fat snap ring you're going to shoot across the shop when you take it out. <laughs> slide hammer, whatever you got to do. Gently. Take that little bearing out. Now, everything just slides right up. And remember to put this in before you put the axles in because once, once the axles are in, you can't slide this past. So there, that's how you get the axle out of those. It's uh, annoying and tedious, but that's how you do it.